Hey everybody, what's good? What's poppin'? It's your girl, the 478 Princess. Today, we're gonna be doing a little get ready with me, but I kinda did it backwards. So I did this and then ended up showering. So it is kinda backwards, but don't mind me, okay? Don't don't mind me. So I started off with my skincare and what I did was do the witch hazel on a little round cleansing pad. Not cleansing pad, but cotton round, you know. And then let that dry. I went ahead and put on my bio oil and I put this all over. I put this in spots where I had dark marks. I put this in spots where I had a little bit of acne, you know, got that cleared up, got out the makeup bag. And then we started working on them brows. Y'all don't know, I absolutely adore this e.l.f. brow pencil. E.l.f. you did your thing. And the fact that it's so affordable is even better. Um, so I did that. I was really concentrating and I was not playing like I was not playing at all with this and you can kind of see like a little shiny spot in the corner of my eye so like ignore that. <laughs> And see who did my brows. I didn't clean them up with concealer or anything because I just thought it made it look a little bit more natural if I didn't. Um, did some more uh bio oil around the nose because my nose is just entirely too dry. Sorry if you can hear the dogs barking. Um, and then I went in with this NK lip pencil in cocoa and then I started lining my lips. I don't overline my lips because my lips I feel like they're a decent size to where I don't want to do that. And then also, whenever I'm talking. Like, you know how sometimes you can tell when somebody overlined their lip? Yeah, we're not going to You know, that. to each his own, though. I did do that, and then I cleaned up. Whenever I did feel like I overlined, I went ahead and I cleaned it up because I don't want to overline lips. Now I'm back. We are going to be using Fortune Cookie by NYX or NYX, the Butter Gloss. You know, this is the... Uh, the staple in some people's makeup routine. I seen someone use this before. I tried a lip combo, it just did not eat on me. And I think this is awesome for like an everyday look. I got it from Yasmin off TikTok. She does like wigs, she does not makeup, she does a lot of stuff, she just introduced gaming. And then I got this NK lip balm, which looks like a lip gloss, and I put it on my lips. Then I got this gauze. Gauze, I gotta stop seeing gauze. This gauze, and then I put it in between. And then it like does it because I noticed it was on my lips, but I don't like how this lip combo makes my teeth look yellow. Like I have porcelain colored teeth, you know, and the fact that it makes it look yellow, I ain't really feeling that. But anywho, put in some gold hoop earrings. I was low key feeling it. Now we're switching to some lashes. We're putting on lashes. These are from Kiu. Couldn't really find proper glue and stuff. I don't know where all my lash stuff went. I had a whole bunch. It just started disappearing. Can y'all tell I just want to sit here and talk? <laughs> so I don't think I'm going to really like talk whenever I do my lashes. I'm just going to let the background music play probably. But I'm going to just tell y'all the lash map that I use is not really spectacular, but it does make a difference. Makes it look like kind of like a classic set, but not really. Just natural, you know. I used five twelves and then I used three nines or tens. I believe it was nines. And it all is from the Q set. And I know I'm getting all close and personal. Y'all can see my skin because a little smoothing effect ain't working. But anywho. See, what I was going to do was just let the music play, but I let it play for a little bit. And I realized whenever I was editing the footage that I actually didn't want to put it in because I was in that little wraparound Velcro towel, you know, and I just didn't feel like that was very right for me to come on here. Anyway, so I did my bottom lashes. That's what the last clip was. And this is me trying to get um, this tied. I mean, this lip liner that I got on this freaking jersey I just got. It was a Demon Slayer one. And I was like, maybe that's God telling me not to wear this. You know, the anime or whatever. Anywho, so it would not come off. So, like, I'm going to hope it come off because I only wore it one time and I literally just bought it. <laughs> Empty who? It was not coming off. But I just wanted to say thank you for watching this video. I hope that you enjoyed it. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe and more sit down videos will be coming because it seems like I'm too lazy. Well, I've been procrastinating editing um, longer style videos. So I'll see y'all in the next video. Love ya.